Hello and welcome to Pregnancy Info. Today we will clear the myths that are related to ovulation. 10 ovulation myths will be debunked in this video. If you are trying for a baby, understanding how ovulation works will give you the best chance of becoming pregnant. However, research shows that as much as 40% of the claims made about conception are inaccurate. So, we dispel some commonly fertility myths and give you the fact. Number 1. You always ovulate on day 14 of your cycle. The length of the menstrual cycle varies from women to women, but the average is every 28 days. Regardless of how long or short the cycle is, ovulation will usually happen around 10 to 16 days before the start of the tax period. Why not take a look at the Emma's Diary ovulation calculator which uses information about your menstrual cycle to work out when your most fertile period is likely to be. Number 2. You can only get pregnant if you have sex on the day you ovulate. Although it's true that your egg is only viable for up to 24 hours because sperm can survive in the vagina, uterus or fallopian tubes for up to 7 days. You can actually get pregnant if you have sex any time during the 7 days before ovulation. Number 3. To be able to conceive you need to have an orgasm. Naturally, your partner must have an orgasm to ensure his sperm can reach the fallopian tubes and the eggs. However, a female orgasm doesn't seem to be required for conception to take place. It's worth noting that there can be leakage of sperm just prior to ejaculation when sperm enters the uterus. Contraction occurs which propel the sperm upward to the fallopian tube. Female orgasm is not required for conception to take place. Number 4. You must have intercourse every day or your fertile period to become pregnant. The maximum fertility window is 8 to 9 days of each menstrual cycle, so having sex at any point during this time could lead to conception. The NHS recommends that you have sex every 2 to 3 days during the fertile window, usually 12 to 16 days before the start of the next period to increase the chances of getting pregnant. Number 5. It takes longer to get pregnant if you have been on the pill. It is perfectly possible for becoming pregnant as soon as you come off the pill, but it's a good idea to wait until after you have had a natural period to allow time to get in the best physical health of pregnancy. However, it can also take several months for your hormones to return to normal, although as it can take several months before female hormones return to normal, there can be a temporary effect on a female's fertility. There is no evidence that taking the pill has a long-term effect on fertility. There is no evidence that taking the pill has any effect on fertility. Number 6. A rise in your temperature indicates when you are most fertile. The hormones estrogen and progesterone cause your body temperature to change throughout the menstrual cycle. Charting your temperature over several cycles can help you recognize your most fertile days as a rise in temperature occurs just after you have ovulated. You can also use an ovulation predictor kit that measures the levels of luteinizing hormone in your urine, which increase around the time of ovulation. Number 7. Ovulation is painful. For most women, ovulation is pain-free experience although some women feel a one-side pain in their lower abdomen when they ovulate, known as Mittelschmerz or German for middle pain or pain in the middle of the month. It can last just a few minutes to up to a day or two. Number 8. An irregular cycle means you are less fertile. It might be more difficult to get pregnant if you have irregular periods as you may not ovulate regularly. It can also be more difficult to recognize your fertility indicators. There are many potential causes of irregular periods including diet and stress, weight and exercise levels, changes in hormones level, or medical conditions such as polycystic ovary syndrome, 
Having sex every few days throughout your cycle can help when trying for a baby. Number 9. A certain sex positions can increase the chance of pregnancy. There is no evidence that any particular sex position can improve the chances of getting pregnant. However, a position that puts the sperm closer as possible to cervix may be helpful, such as missionary or doggy style, which there is little scientific proof that it may help. Experts suggest lying still with a pillow Propping up your hips after sex may give the sperm a better chance of fertilizing the egg. Number 10. Being over or underweight doesn't affect conception. Research shows that overweight and obese women may have problems of irregular periods and or ovulation as well as an increased risk of infertility, miscarriage and hormone sensitive carcinomas. Being underweight can cause irregular periods which can also make it more difficult to conceive. The irregular periods can also be a sign that you are not ovulating which is needed to get pregnant. As such, being a healthy weight gives you the best chance of becoming pregnant. So, this is all about the myths about ovulation. Hope it will be clear to you and you must share this video to the females who are not clear about the concept of ovulation. Thank you.